Come on, here's an ice break. How many strikes does it take to break it? Mm -hmm. An ice break? What? A single strike will do it. Believe it or not, if you pulp paper and freeze it into ice, even 10 strikes can't break. Uh -huh. Frozen paper pulp can withstand 10 strikes? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Let's have a try. Take two liters of water and freeze your grains of waste paper, then pulp the paper with water. Oh, it's soothing! For how long? For half an hour. That's overwhelming! Oh. <laughs> Keep grinding until the paper is completely pulped. Once the paper pulp is done, pour it into a mold and place it in the freezer for freezing. Finally, we got a nice block. Now let's see how sturdy it is. Why bother? It takes one strike! Watch out! Biaguala, <laughs> biaguala. Nine strikes to go. Let's do it outdoors. Let's see how many strikes it takes to break the ice break. Huh. If I can't break this, I'll eat my hat! Eight strikes to go. Six strikes to go. Come on! Only four strikes left. I did some research. The composite material made from paper pulp plus water is called hydrate. The paper pulp significantly enhances the tensile strength of the ice and prevents cracks from spreading. So a hammer can't do the job. 